So you've probably definitely heard of the term amnesia. Well, today, okay, so, well, there are two types of amnesia. There is retrograde amnesia, which this form of amnesia is kind of like the kind you've probably seen on like TV and stuff, or at least very similar to it, um, in which what happens is like after an injury or a traumatic event, um, your memory or your records or whatever, memory things, you might lose um, a couple of days of your uh, memory or so as, um, or like what was being processed into your brain. And let's say you go through an injury, well, that kind of messes up the process. Therefore, anything that was still during the process is going to be wiped out. So that's why some people during head injuries, they don't remember things during that happened um, hours, even, even days before the event. Now, there's another form of amnesia. Oh, I'm sorry. Um, so just think, okay, for retrograde amnesia, just think of your mind. Think of the mind being like a computer, and you're working on an assignment, and every, t like you're working on a document, every 10 minutes the document saves. Well, let's say for instance, you've been working really hard and all of a sudden your power goes out. Me, that, so basically, the stuff that wouldn't say during that, um, so basically you're gonna lose, lose all that information that didn't already get saved. So, therefore, um, yeah, just like, yeah, I guess you get the picture. <laughs> okay. Then there's a thing called anorgrade amnesia, which is, it, it's um, when after a traumatic event, you have difficulty remembering after that event. So, um, like, good example would be a concussion. Now, back to what I was saying about the, uh, about how, back to the computer analogy. So let's just say this is your long-term memory. This is a hard drive. So angel grade amnesia will be finding out that your hard drive is defective, meaning you can't save anything new. So if so, let's say you have a, a document pulled up. So um, once you close that document, it's gone forever. You're never going to be able to recover it. That's kind of how this form of amnesia works. Once it leaves your mind, it's gone. And it's going to be very difficult to try to um, remember it again. Um, it's, all, it's also one of the earlier stages in Alzheimer's disease, disease, which actually include Alzheimer's actually includes both retrograde and and, and anorograde. But um, the anorograde is what you see at the beginning when people start um, forgetting, like, if you, you might be cooking and stuff. And then you might walk away for a minute and then forget that you were cooking something and you might stop something on the stove. And possibly, you know, that could be de very dangerous. Um, and like I said, a concussion is a more temporary version of it, but it can be permanent, just like the other one. But, and I uh, for forgot to say, but I did get this from Pearson, fourth edition psychology which is my psychology book. Mm -hmm. So anyway, um, that's all I have to say. Any questions? Yes. Yeah.